Right guys, let look, let's look at capacity and volume. The first thing you need to learn is to get an idea of how much is a milliliter, how much is a liter and how much is a kiloliter. Remember, capacity ties in very closely with volume, but capacity, the name capacity we only use when we speak about liquids being measured. Now, I'm going to go back to volume and I'm going to show you, if you look closely at this little rubrics cube here, can you see that one of these little cubes would, well, we could say that this one is one centimeters long, one centimeter wide and one centimeter high. That would give me a volume of one centimeter cubed. So if you think of one of these little blocks in your rubrics cube, one out of the 27, then that one little cube would hold one milliliter of liquid. So now you've got an idea of how much one milliliter is. Now, if you have a thousand of those little cubes, that brings you to one liter. So if we times that by a thousand, we'll get a thousand milliliters equals one liter. And you guys know one liter from a milk carton. That would be a one liter milk carton there. If I take a thousand of those milk cartons, a thousand liters would be one kiloliter. And that's, I hope some of you have seen a tank like that. That tank holds one kiloliter of water. Right, let's now look at when we measure in jugs, how are we going to read from the jug? You must know that not all jugs count in the same amount. So I'm just going to head back here. So firstly, when I ask you to read the amount of liquid in a jug or a container, you can answer me in one of three ways. You can give your answer in liters and milliliters. So for example, one liter, 750 milliliters. You could even put a little and in there. Or we could combine the two and only give our answer in milliliters. That's then 1,750 milliliters because you know the one liter holds 1,000 milliliters. Now, if I have... If I want to give my answer in liters, I'll have a decimal number and it'll be 1,75. Remember that zero at the end? That is 750 milliliters, yes. But the zero at the end of a decimal means nothing, so I can leave it out. So that's an optional little zero there. Right, let's look at our jugs. To read a measurement on a container, count gaps in a liter. Um, count the gaps in a liter. So you want to see how many gaps you see to get to one liter in that container. Now divide a thousand milliliters by the amount of gaps that you see and that will be what you are counting in. Example, when I look at this, I've got how many gaps in a liter? Now, the easiest thing for me to do is to go from one liter to two liter. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. There's one, two, three, four, five. I'm not currently looking at the yellow line where the liquid is. I'm just looking at there's five gaps. So I've counted five gaps. I need to, t and that makes up a liter. So I take a thousand milliliters. Remember, that is a liter. And I divide it by 5. That means e each gap is 200 milliliters. So, in other words, up to here, I'll have 200. By there, I'll be at 400. There, I'll be at 600, 800. And obviously, the 1 liter is where I would reach 1,000. And then, so I didn't really, did I need to do all that at the bottom? No, not really. I could have started here and said, okay, 
Well, my liquid is lying two gaps above a liter. So it's a liter plus 200 plus 200. So that'll be one liter plus 200 moles plus 200 milliliters. And that's one liter and 400 milliliters. Also written as one comma four liters. This one works differently. You'll see that here I only reach one liter right at the top. Again, always start by counting your gaps. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten gaps before I reach a liter. So again, I take one liter, that's the thousand, and I divide it by ten because that's the gaps. And that tells me that I'm counting in hundreds. So up to there I'll be at 100, there I'll be at 200, and here I'll be at 300. So my answer here is I'm looking at 300 milliliters. If you were asked to write that as a liter, it would be 0, 0,3 liters.